Welcome. Today, we'll be going through question three from the Iran Maths Olympiad 2014. Let x, y, and z be three non-negative real numbers such that x squared plus y squared plus z squared is equal to two multiplied by x, y plus y, z plus z, x. Prove that x plus y plus z divided by three is greater or equal to the cubic root of two x, y, z. Please pause the video here and have a think about the problem on your own before proceeding to the hints and solutions. Hint number one. So we know that x squared plus y squared plus z squared is equal to two multiplied by xy plus yz plus zx. Can you think of any expression that includes these terms, for example, in some sort of expansion of a common factorization? Hint number two. So x plus y plus z squared is equal to x squared plus y squared plus z squared plus 2xy plus 2xz plus 2yz. So we may find after some investigation that this equality is not too useful. The reason being it's too symmetric. So why not we try to subtly change the left-hand side? For example, by replacing one of the plus signs to a minus sign. Hint number three. Also note that x plus y plus z divided by three is equal to x plus y minus z plus x plus y minus z plus tz, all divided by three. Solution. So we begin by noticing that x plus y plus z squared is equal to x squared plus y squared plus z squared plus two xy plus two xz plus two yz. But this alone will not get us very far because it's a bit too symmetric. So we change the left-hand side a little bit to get x plus y minus z squared. And this gives us x squared plus y squared plus z squared plus 2xy minus 2xz minus 2yz. Now we can replace the x squared plus y squared plus z squared with 2xy plus 2yz plus 2zx from the inequality we're given to get 4xy. So x plus y minus z squared is equal to 4xy. Now, we notice the inequality we need to prove is very similar to the AMGM inequality, except for the fact that there's an extra 2. So we would like to try and prove it with the AMGM inequality, but obviously we need to change x, y, and z. So why not we change them with x plus y minus z, x plus y minus z, and 2z. This would make sense, but we need to ensure that x plus y minus z is non-negative because the AMGM inequality only works with non-negative reals. But due to the symmetry of the problem, without loss of generality, we can have x be greater or equal to y be greater or equal to z. And so then x plus y minus z is greater or equal to zero. And so now we are dealing with non-negative reals. And so we have x plus y plus z divided by three equal to x plus y minus z divided by two plus x plus y minus z divided by two plus two z all divided by three greater or equal to the cubic root of two z multiplied by x plus y minus z squared divided by four equal to the cubic root of two x y z. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to drop a comment in the comments down below and see you next time.